This is another My View TV exclusive. Please remember to hit the notification bell, like, share, and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple me. Well, go on, my people. Hope everybody doing okay. Hope everybody doing all right. Sometimes when I come and I tell you, say, the police, them know everybody who no think a joke. Me, me come and tell you, say, the police, them are waste time before them take the time and slap with criminal. No for the criminal, them for just get slapped with. And the police, them no business. But people, I couldn't make that one ever had noticed because a big thing going on at Dunkirk. Friday, yes, big big sitting in the man them black road and say yo them call all indicum and indicum no show up cause police come and slap with Rex. Yes people Rex from Rona Dunkirk dead. Rex in the people our oh, dog, the people them come out come Black Road for this time. Yeah, tell you the truth. The man them say the police them slap with community dog. And the people them vex. I want to think I joke me and make the police them could drive on the road freely around and the man them black road and say they want justice to Rex. Anyway, I could deal the rest of the news now. The police in St. Thomas are probing circumstances surrounding attempt arson and shooting on a family while they were sleeping. Yes, while the family has sleep, people plan for burn down the house and shoot them up. Incident happened at about 10.30 on Thursday night in a community called Duane Pen. It is reported that the couple and their three children were asleep in their two-bedroom concrete dwelling when they were awoken by a loud explosion and smell of gasoline. Upon making check, it was discovered that a note assailant fire shot at the house and fire bomb the back of the structure, partially burning a wind the bathroom. The police say a second house located some 60s meter away and which is believed to be occupied by the security guard father was also shot up. The police indicate that no one was injured in either of the incident and that the investigation is ongoing. Let me tell you something now. The people them know. Them know where them get themselves in. Yes, them know where them get themselves in about there. You know? And the people them are the community know where them get themselves in. So when they see them come and I move like that, people, me not to feel sorry for them. You know? me, I'll be honest with you. Know? Sometimes I come and I tell you a lot of things in our life or a lot of things we are me can be avoided. You see, I love video with the brother there. Yes, the brother had the tattoo on him and we slap out the man and them. So that could have be avoided. You know? That could have be avoided. The police them they listen to we and slap with criminal and stop carrying them in and let them out. The police them know him. My police them friend. You see how quick them know which path they go search. And at this way them come and I tell the people them. This case has caused a lot of concern, both for the citizens and the police. Today we are here conducting operations trying to locate this individual which is known to us and um, he will be brought to justice. We will not spare any resources in, in getting him off the street. We will, I can almost tell you that. We are expecting to make some breakthrough very soon. That's what I can say. So who are you now? Let me ask you something, Mr. Officer. You say on the nurse pier, nothing in getting him off of the street. Where am I up on the street in the first place? Who no knows that the boy a criminal? Where him I do on the street? All I needed for the from the last time I slap him away. Mr. Pier, yes, Mr. Pier could have been saved if you take this boy off of the street them long time. But no, 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 no. Only just a hold them. Carry them behind bars and then you let them out. Tell me what kind of sense that make. That makes sense too, no? You know, tell me the truth. Tell me the truth, people.
44 year old Omar Bolton of John Street. I him that pan the ground that's a lie down people. Man, him friend him a play that me know a man. Just drive up and ends the people them say one teeth with pink sticker. Just drive up and slap some shot pan them. Yes, and him there grum. You can see me in a knuckle green shot. We have the pics, I have the pictures, I have everything. Video everything for show the people and me could not see what I go on and whoever know him. Yes. Who oh, no, no, know I mix up in a I don't know, but you know a bag of people are come come say yo are go the out. We and them grow, we and them this our little marble friend. But like how we dep on the ends there. Like how we dep on the ends there. We are going to finish the war going another little circle. Like, remember me, they tell the people about the little dark side and genocide war. So the tension, I in Tel Aviv. Yes, the tension, I. But before me, I couldn't know everything. I could hear from one of the bus survivors. This is how the bus survivor have to say. As the bus move up, mm. we look on the side. Mm. When we can't see the man them over there, so, but not me, none of them mm. come from boy, I mean, I know. They say about three to four man just have come off of the ill thing like mm -hmm. two hours about everybody have gone gun. And it's open fire. That's all I'm saying. And they start to cover. Everybody start panic and as if I sink the bus I sink. Those who don't remember me, me refresh on the mind. Alright? In a January to be exact the 28th of January when them go down and them slap a try turlang aka weed seed that is 23 when no live no life no life him no live and him is a member of the genocide gang remember me they come come telling you, you know and people like comment section say no lie the matter like you they are good youth that you are not involved in nothing Hmm? I don't remember all of them something eh? I don't remember? No, I see it played out now. Let me tell you something now. The bus load of people. Me just sorry say them never dig one little hole and drop a hole of them up in night up the same time. Because if you do not, you're not supposed to feel. When bus load of people are going to funeral, I'm going to business who are coming in the comment section, come cuss and say them are going to unfollow this and unsubscribe from this. Who no can go on after me never beg on the Tanya. Me now pick up for no criminal element on a dirty lifestyle. Ten on the yard, ten on the supposed to go, ten go on and ten come back. We bust load of people ago, eh? And that's why they get wet up. This is not the first time it's going on up here. Good. A few times when this happened up here. Yeah. Well, break out of the already where people lose all them hands. You understand? Mm -hmm. I think they need to put some more tougher measures in place in terms of security. For yourself, all the people in that little here afraid because they must say this is not the first time every time them look at things happen. But guess what? The man, police allow them to angle them, bangle themselves. It's like I could not see what I go on. And if you don't believe me, see a gang violence really I go on. See the picture you have to show, say the man them go retaliate the same night. I mean, no the people them are come to ask. How is it that the man them go shoot up a funeral and the police them never say make them go plant a post down there and protect your people? The police them now go down and go protect them. The police them now go down there. The police them allow them to angle them, bangle themselves because too much criminal down there and too much people down there hide up the criminal. Them. Yeah, man, also, man, when they claim they're innocent, who the down there hide up criminal? So, angle no bangle on yourself. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Come check us out, alright?